Believe it or not, the seal pup is based on a true story. It happened on a coast like this one, maybe not far from where I'm standing. I saw it in a documentary, an amazing documentary that I've never been able to find since. So I'm going to tell you a little bit about it in the hopes that one of you can help me find it. In this documentary, all these seals were swimming around in the water, having a good time, and all of a sudden this huge great white shark swam up. So all the seals got out of the water as fast as they possibly could, except for a few seals that were stuck in the water because the shark was between them and the land. And it looked like the shark was going to eat these seals. And all the seals on land were barking at that shark as loud as they could. But there was nothing else they could do because it's a shark. And then one little seal swam out to the shark right up to its head and he started swimming in slow circles around the shark's head. And you could see the shark's eyes start to follow this little seal. And it forgot about all the others. And that little seal was able to turn the shark around and lead it out to sea, away from the others, until they just disappeared into the blue. And I could not believe my eyes, because how was that little seal so kind that he would risk his life for the other seals? And how was he so brave that he would swim up to a great white shark, right up to its head? And how did he know how to do it? How do you learn how to do that without getting eaten? So that was the beginning of the story. But I saw that documentary back in 2001, and I've never been able to find it since. So I'm hoping that one of you has seen it. Or if you haven't seen it, that you have better hunting skills than I do and can track it down. If you do, mail me a copy to this address. And remember to include a self-addressed stamped envelope so I can send it back to you. Now, if you know the name of it and where I can find it, but you can't send me a copy, just send me the information and I'll hunt it down as quickly as I can. The first person to reunite me with this documentary will win not only my undying gratitude, but also your own underwater camcorder so that you can tell your own underwater stories or just horse around with your friends. For those of you who care to take this challenge up, I thank you. I wish you luck, and I hope to hear from you soon.